guys it's katie what's up so i'm back and did a little makeover so if you can tell um before my hair was like decently long and then it had like a lot of uh leftover purple dye um because my hair was purple but my roots were always too dark so i should have just bleached it but i didn't want to pay for that so Basically, I chopped my hair off and then I actually did a look kind of inspired by like some of the trendy mullet cuts. Like I know it's not full, but I wanted that like choppy bang. Um, not the bang. The bang. Not the bang. The bang. Anyways, so yeah, that's what's new. Um, today we're doing a um, Killstar haul because I have no self-control. <gasps> Um, just kidding, but yeah, it's about, well, 400, I think it's almost like 350 worth of stuff from Killstar Canadian and then like two something um, American, probably like 250, I don't know. It's a little wild, so um, yeah, government checks, oops. Um, so <laughs> today we're doing a haul from Killstar. It's like a summer 2020 um there's a cute little floaty in there um, and some fall stuff too because I figured I don't have a lot of more uh, gothy alternative fall stuff. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so actually it's interesting because I've never really had like a good um, lighting setup when I did like Killstar hauls and they usually do well so that's probably why nobody stuck around. <laughs> okay, um, stay for the personality. Okay. <laughs> This is the first piece. This is probably my favorite thing in the, um, I was going to say in the collection, in the haul. Um, cute tags, as always. Um, this is in a size large, so there's a fully functioning zipper um, in the front um, with little skull decal, and then it has some, I think these are called D-rings, not O-rings. Um, and then zippers and it does fit it fits pretty tight I used to get mediums from Killstar but like now like I feel like the large fits and I'm more of a medium um, on top so yeah I'll show a little um, try on of everything there's adjustable straps as well and the straps are pretty di dirty sturdy um, so that you can wear actually this without a bra if you're comfortable because I feel like it's a tight fit up top you know, if you've got the goods, you know, but if not, it probably keeps you strapped in too. So I really like this punky kind of maybe mall gothy, you know, it has some little bit of, I don't know, new gothy punk vibes to it that I feel like is very, it's a bit more wearable if you're into kind of alternative wear and very sexy on, um, it's decently cropped. Okay, this next piece is going to be a bit harder to show, like, the back detail, but it's basically um, just a basic tea in tea, a basic tank in the front. So it's, like, like this, and then very wearable. Um, even my sis, who's more into, more into more, I guess, trendy, kind of more everyday style. Um, not more, more basic, but you know what I mean, not in a bad way. Um, but in the back, it has kind of a pentagram um, inspired strappiness to it. Um, this one I did get in a size medium um, just because I felt like the straps aren't adjustable. So just in case I would get a medium. So it is a tighter fit, but I've already worn it and washed it. And I don't believe it shrunk yet. So she's still looking good. Super cute basic. I need to buy more basics instead of buying elaborate outfits. Or dresses like this but just wear you know I'll definitely wear this piece so I mean I'm wearing everything but this more often okay so this little purchase here um, is a pair of sunglasses so it comes um, in this case I've actually worn them a lot um, I didn't really clean them before um, but um, yeah I've worn these out a lot they actually do have um, UV protection um, and they're um, I don't know yeah Killster has done sunglasses before but I've kind of been a bit more uh, like not interested I guess because 
I didn't trust that the quality be, quality would be so nice. Um, so yeah, they're like a little cat eye with moons. Um, and I was very surprised that they came with um, the case too as well um, because it like kind of snaps closed with a little like magnetic thing, which is really convenient for traveling um, or just running errands. I feel like a lot of, um, no, sorry. I feel like me personally, I always just kind of throw around cheaper sunglasses. Um, and I don't even really trust myself buying a more elaborate designer sunglass just because I feel like it would get scratched. Maybe if I'm going out on a patio, she's getting a little crazy, you know? So these are a good alternative. I think they were only $25 or so. Uh, Canadian, so they're really worth it in my opinion. Um, I was pleasantly surprised by these with the cute little moon detail and I'm wearing them out every time I really run an errand, so I'm very um, into these. Okay, I moved a little bit back just to show you the this um, sweater dress. So um, this is a fall piece. Oop. So um, cute little tag. I always appreciate the tags. I actually usually keep them. Um, I don't know if that's really necessary, but anyways, I enjoy them, you know. So this one says um, Bad Witches Club. So that's probably like an ode to Bad Bitches Club. I don't know if there's one out there, you know. I'm, I'm part of it. No, I'm just kidding. But <laughs> so. This has like three little witchy um, gals um, and then it kind of has like some wolves here in the moon and some skulls on the bottom. So yeah, love this. Um, it's a nice, I think it's a nice cotton material. Um, it's more baggy on. I did get a size large in this um, just because on the bottom, you know, the girls got the hips. So I can't be buying a medium and then you know, getting stuck on the bottom. So, so yeah, it's super comfy. I can see myself wearing this um, out for out at the bar with my man to get some drinks. But you know, like get some pints. <laughs> so um, yeah, love this. Um, I can see myself wearing this a lot. I'm trying to buy more casual, like um, witchy, gothy pieces that I like. And y'all know I've been up on my little um, Wicca things. So I even bought some herbs recently. Um, I'm more into crystals lately. So she's about that witchy life. And I really like this. And I don't have a lot of graphic pieces. I don't have this, but like graphic um, sweater dresses. Um, I actually really like wearing dresses too just because they're a bit more comfortable than wearing pants all the time. Like, even though it's a little bit more girly, I mean, if they have a little bit of spunk or edge, then I'm into it. Okay, so this next piece is kind of interesting. This one was on sale. So we actually have the name of it. It's the Stel Stella Luna Cardigan. Um, and, ooh, a different tag in this one lip fast shop online okay <laughs> so it has a hood as well it's actually um, a multi-purpose item it is a dress and then a zipper that zips all the way down so you can wear this um, as a dress you can make it a little long show the girls uh, <laughs> and then actually you can take um, this moon chain off um, it has a little um, clasp, yeah, a clasp, and then you can take this off so that when you unzip it, it can be a cardigan, and then you can fully take this off, or I guess you could keep it on too, so, and then the hood kind of adds like a medieval element that I really like. I thought this piece was great because I do love cardigans. I realized that I have this like blue cloudy cardigan and I've literally worn it like so much. So I guess I'm just like Kurt Cobain wearing cardigans, you know? So really love that. Super comfy, could make it a dress. She's a little medieval sorcerer girl, ooh. Yeah, so kind of found this at the end of the haul and just felt like I needed it. 
Okay, we're back close up again. Okay, so I'm actually done with clothes for this haul, um, for the video at least. Um, there's three more things coming, which is actually kind of a lot, but hey, enjoy. So this next thing, I had my um, eye on for a while. Um, it did actually, this is actually, the pillowcases do sell out and some of the shower curtains and kind of home decor. They also have home decor um which is good quality as well so far um so this fits like a normal size pillow i did measure it so it has a ouija board design that says mystical spirit board and you got all the goods here you know it might freak some people out but i love that kind of thing in horror but i have actually played with them one when i was younger and it did work so i'm a little spooked by that but i feel like as long as you're not like conjuring up bad spirits it should be okay right just gotta protect yourself when you're doing that okay so this actually is a little big for some of my smaller pillows like in terms of not being able to completely fill out the uh pillow so it might be a little floppier on some smaller pillows but otherwise it's not like it's too small which would be bleh, which would be worse right so love this really comfy for sleeping i have them in my bed right now so it comes with a set of two and they weren't that expensive i swear they were like 30 dollars, 25 which i feel like isn't too bad at all i don't know i feel like bedding is a lot more expensive they also have like um bed sh bed sheets and blankets and stuff like that so you can take a look at that too on their like home decor okay um and then the next piece i'm going to talk about actually is in here it's at my little cottage i have a little cottage by the lake Ooh. um okay ooh. so anyways i'll show you like a video of some photos that i took with the goth gothicorn floaty so it's like a unicorn floaty but it's black and it has some stars and stuff on it and they're actually if you're into like unicorn floaties i do have like a regular big one that i have too so i got a little friend for my first unicorn um float but they only have like in stores and kind of beachy stores, which actually are kind of closed now because of COVID, but you know, um, there's a black swan. So if you're looking for like a gothy floaty, the black swan, the black swan is like the only thing you can find that's like a black floaty. So this one is a black unicorn, which is very like, I swear like people who knew me knew that was like unicorns are my thing. And they became really trendy and it was kind of cringe, but it's a black gothy, you know, it's a gothy unicorn. So we're into that. Um, yeah, so I'll be making waves with that. And that one was a bit more expensive. That one was like $70. It was kind of the reason why I felt like I needed to get the rest of the stuff. Well, mainly because I was like, girl, um, and Oh yeah, one thing I will say that if you're shopping um, shopping on Killstar from Canada, I wouldn't get um, express shipping. Um, it did come with free um, express shipping, which will, will come with a lot of customs, but it will be here in like three days. So if you're shopping from there, if you use the USPS option, it usually takes about three weeks, two to three weeks, maybe regular, um, and then Otherwise in COVID, it takes a lot longer, but there isn't any customs, but you're still paying for shipping. So sometimes with, when you get free shipping, it will give you the option to have DHL shipping um, for free, which is like express, but it will come with customs, but it will come in a few days. So in a way it only, it balances out sort of with costs. I'd say you're paying maybe an extra 40 to get it here soon, but I needed it for my um, little bikini gothy vision. So <laughs> I'm a little extra, so, but I really like it and I'll be keeping it forever. So we got it for next summer too. Okay, here we are in my bathroom. So the other piece that I bought is a Killstar shower curtain. So I'm really interested in just getting this for my bathroom because my old one was kind of like some floral stuff and my mom's like, no problem, get one. You know, she's, she supports my little fashion, you know, because this is my bathroom now. 
my own because my sister uh, recently moved out. So here she is in her glory. So um, yeah, it's a bit having a bit of a glare right now, but it fit perfectly overall. And um, I thought like somehow it wouldn't be a like machine washable or anything like that, but the uh, material is waterproof and you know it's black which is great for my black hair dye because literally my purple hair would stain my other one so yeah I'm very into it um, and it fits perfectly in like an average shower so even if you've been looking on them looking on Killstar for shark curtains I would recommend Okay, that is all for the little haul. Um, if you like this video, subscribe. Um, I try to make these kind of videos a bit more fun, a bit less basic and peeps out there. Oops, you know, crack some jokes. Um, I also do a lot of uh, gothy inspired alternative content. Uh, I try to put out more content lately or more so, I mean. And yeah, um, I might do a little like small biz alternative haul. I'm big into deep pop now. She's just so quirky, like all the little alternative babes out there lately. And I'll see you next one. Bye.